Today we're going to look at algebraic equations. Now you might have already done some work on equations, but what I'm wanting to do is go right back to the beginning. So let's not head into all the fancy rules or whatever you might know. Let's just start with trying to make sure we really understand the language of algebra and what it's saying to us. So what I want us to look at is translating an algebraic equation back into English, into words. So what I've got here is the equation 5x is equal to 15. What does that say to us? Well, the first thing we need to immediately know is that when we write 5x, algebra shorthand, it's just shorthand for 5 times x, right? You know that by now, that when you just put 5 next to the x, in algebra, you leave out the time sign. So what 5x means is 5 times x. So what this says to us, what does this equation say to us? It says 5 times something gives me 15. 5 times something gives me 15. Putting it into nice language, what this says is when I multiply the number by 5, I get 15. And when I put it that way, it's quite easy for me to figure out what the number, that mystery number that x is standing in place of, is. The answer there is obviously going to be 3, because it's 3 that when I multiply by 5, I get 15. OK, try this one for yourself. Um, try and write down in your homework books what the equation 3x plus 1 equals 10 means or would stand for in English. Pause the video now and try it. Okay, so what you should have got is this idea. If you take your mystery number, the number x, and you multiply it by 3 and then add 1, you'll get the answer, 10. Remember, order of operations, your bed mass, bod mass, whatever you want to call it, applies equally well when you're doing equations and algebra. So what you've got here is x multiplied by 3 plus 1, and so multiplication has to come first. So it's take the number, multiply it by 3, then add 1, and you'll get the answer of 10. And so what we're talking about is if I multiply a number by 3 and then add 1, I get 10. That's the translation. And hopefully you can see quite easily that that mystery number that you're talking about will be 3. Because 3 times 3 is 9 plus 1 is 10.